you're seeing here is a technique known as flash cuts. This technique dates back to when videos were all shot on film. Flash cuts often involve a noticeable speeding up and slowing down of the footage, which originally occurred due to the physical motors in a film camera. To replicate this effect in post-production, start by applying a speed ramp to your first and second clips. Right click on your clip, go to show clip keyframes, time remapping, and then select speed. Place your playhead a few frames before the first clip ends. Click this keyframe here, and then pull this line up to increase the speed. Repeat this on the second clip, but a few frames after the start. Then select the curve icon to adjust the transition for a more polished effect. Next, create an adjustment layer, positioning it above your clips so that it spans three frames to the left and three frames to the right. Now search for Lumetri Color in your effects panel and drag it onto the adjustment layer. Go to the exposure setting, move the playhead to the start of the adjustment layer and create keyframes by selecting the keyframe icon. Then move forward a few frames and increase the exposure to its maximum. This creates a subtle yet impactful effect that's perfect for music videos or any project where you want to add a vintage film vibe. For an extra touch, try adding a directional blur to the adjustment layer. Start at the beginning of the adjustment layer, set a keyframe, move forward a few frames, and adjust the blur length to around six. This gives the effect a smoother, more cohesive look. Adding sound effects can further enhance this effect, making your video more dynamic and engaging. Thanks for watching this tutorial, and if you find it helpful, make sure to leave us a comment like the video and subscribe for more editing tips and tutorials.